Good morning, you guys. I am going to do a um, what my toddler eats in a day today, which you guys probably already know that from the title, but I hope you guys do enjoy it. Zaya is 18 months. She'll actually be 19 months next week. Um, she has her days. Some days she's super picky. Some days she eats great and tries different things and likes them. So it really just depends. Um, I'm just doing what Zaya eats in a day just because she's here all day with me. And this gives you an idea of what she usually eats. Um, Monroe, if you guys are new, she is six. She usually is at school. When she is home or if she is at school, she's usually eating the same exact things. Um, for school, she'll either want a um, sandwich, either a peanut butter and jelly or a ham and cheese. She'll, she will even eat like boiled eggs, um, tuna fish sandwiches, which I could do a um, like lunch, lunch box idea type thing for like a week of what she eats. Um, she even eats salad sometimes. So she she's a very good eater. Um, but this video is just gonna be what my toddler eats in a day. I will show you guys exactly what she eats and give you a ballpark of the things that she, like what she will eat. So like this morning, I'm gonna go ahead and whip her up some eggs. Um, this morning, Monroe is actually home from school today. She's sick, she has a stomach bug. So she is locked up in her room. Um, sh the past couple days has been super, super hard. Um, she's just been just not feeling herself at all. Um, she is getting better though today, so that is good. But she's on a very, very um, light diet. So her meals are only consisting of like toast, jello, applesauce, and soup. So I'm not gonna show you guys what she eats in a day just because today she's not feeling well. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and whip Zai up some eggs. The days that she doesn't eat eggs, which I try to give them eggs as much as possible for breakfast, but if they don't, then they usually eat oatmeal. Sometimes they'll, they'll want cereal or they will want um, pancakes or waffles. But today I'm gonna whip up some, waffle, uh, some eggs. So it's about eight o'clock now. The girls usually eat breakfast at eight or around eight. It just depends on what time they actually wake up in the morning. And then um, I always feed them breakfast before I take Monroe to school. So that is the time that it is right now. you guys so this is what she's eating for breakfast she has uh, two eggs and then some raspberries and blackberries the one thing I can say about her is she loves fruit all fruit so I usually give her some type of fruit at least twice a day um, usually she'll have like a big thing of it for breakfast and then she'll usually have like a snack later on with some kind of fruit in it too which I will show you guys that. But if she's being very, very picky with her food, like if she doesn't touch her eggs or her oatmeal or whatever else it is that I'm giving her, then I will double the fruit. Like I'll give her like basically a big fruit salad. I'll put like bananas and raspberries, blackberries, blueberries, oranges, and she will devour it. And then she's also drinking water.
guys can tell she ate all of the raspberries and blueberries and she did finish quite a bit of her eggs but she wanted an orange so I went ahead and gave her that I told you guys she loves fruit like I could literally sit here and feed her fruit all day and she'd be okay all right you guys it is about two o'clock right now Zaya just woke up from her nap and I know she took a seriously long nap today. She took a three hour nap. I put her down at 11. So sometimes she'll eat lunch before she takes a nap and sometimes it's after. It really just depends on how big her breakfast is and how cranky she is. She didn't, she had some of my breakfast, which I just had some cereal for breakfast. So she um, ate some of my cereal and before she laid down to take her nap. So she's up right now. I'm gonna show you guys what she is eating. Okay, so this is what she's eating for lunch today. She, as you guys saw, she went into the fridge and went into the drawer and picked out this orange herself. So I told you guys she loves fruit, especially oranges and bananas. So she's eating this, she's banging for me to bring it to her. So let me bring it over here actually. <laughs> yeah, are you ready to eat? Okay, so she's eating some pretzels, an orange, and a piece of string cheese. And then this is a Uncrustable, the strawberry and peanut butter flavor. That's her favorite one. Is it good? <coughs> <laughs> Do you want some juice? Mm. Yeah, you want some juice? All right, and then I usually let her have one thing of juice for the day. Sometimes she won't even get juice for the day. Sometimes it's, I mean, it really just depends. Um, but if she does get juice, this is the juice that I get her. It's 100% apple juice. And then I give her probably half, maybe not even half actually. And then the rest is the water. So this is usually how lunchtime goes. Sometimes she'll eat more, but usually if she has a good breakfast, she doesn't really have a good lunch. Like she'll barely touch it and she'll just play, see? So she did take a couple bites of her peanut butter and jelly and then a couple bites of her string cheese, but she ate the whole orange <laughs> and her um, pretzels. So usually on the days that she does this, it's usually she'll eat a good breakfast and then a good dinner, but not a good lunch. Or sometimes it's just one of the meal and she picks at two of them. So like she might even pick at dinner, but we will see. Are you all done? Say all done. It's about 4 30. All right, you guys, so it's about 4.30 now, and I am about to start making dinner soon. Um, but this is Zaya's snack. She's just eating the rest of the pretzels that she had for lunch today. All right, you guys, it is 5.30, so now I just finished cooking dinner. So this is what Zaya's going to eat. Um, she usually eats the same thing that we eat for dinner, unless it's something that's, like, spicy. 
Um, so we're having tacos tonight, Taco Tuesday. So I just gave her some ground turkey and put some cheese in it. I gave her a piece of the tortilla and then um, some tomato and I drizzled some Italian dressing on it and then a little bit of avocado. She probably won't touch this, but we'll see. <laughs> So at the time that Zaya was eating, she literally picked at it. She ate, she picked at it and then she had an attitude because she didn't want to eat it. She rather just played. Um, dinner is usually always the hardest for us because she, I don't know, I don't know what it is. She just, she just wants to be wild and free. She doesn't want to be sitting down for some reason at dinner time, even though we're all sitting at the table. I don't know but so as I is done she's just fussing and she wants to be done <laughs> I went to the bathroom came back out Malcolm didn't know that I was recording what she ate in a day and he threw her plate away <laughs> so I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like because it's actually right on top of the trash so that way you guys can see how much she did eat and didn't eat so sorry if you guys think this is trifling, but this is what she did not eat, which she didn't touch the avocado at all. And she ate a couple pieces of the tomato and then mostly she ate um, the turkey meat and then she definitely ate all of the tortilla that I gave her. The only thing else that she'll have is um, she might have a couple sips of water um, or, oh, and she also has her milk. She usually has five to six ounces of milk before she goes to bed. Um, and then that's it. So like right now it's almost seven o'clock and Malcolm is giving her a bath. So after that she'll have her milk and then it'll be time for her to go to bed. That is it for this video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you guys are new and I will see you guys in the next one.